seen a lot of posts about cortisol face, Dr. Barrett, board certified plastic surgeon. I do think it's a real thing. Though there's not a real whole lot of studies about it. We do know that when you have excess corticosteroids in your body, you do get puffiness, you do get swelling, you do hold underwater. There's a lot of information out there, not quite study level information about people that are stressed out getting cortisol face or getting puffiness in their face. And it could be related to the stress hormone, which is cortisol, which your body releases in response to stress. So there's people that are marketing supplements to help combat this stress, things like ashkawanda and so forth, which we have some limited evidence that it does help. But the best thing to do, I do think that, you know, your, your body swelling, bloating, all that other stuff is let it related to inflammation and stress 100%. So if you feel like you're getting, like your face has never been puffy before and you're stressed out, it probably is because of your stress. Not to mention if it's not from your stress, taking care of your stress is going to help everything else anyway. So my suggestion is start getting good sleep, doing meditation, doing red light, things that kind of help lower your stress, getting rid of toxic people and relationships, you know, go on down the line, right? If you're noticing certain things in your body that you don't quite like, it might be related to cortisol, it might not be, but handling the stress is going to benefit you in more ways than one.